If they go in, it's going to pass. And so they're doing what they were hired to do. I believe the Democrats should stay and do their job. Opinions are mixed about House Democrats' continued absence from the State House floor. Good evening, I'm Jeff Smith. $1,000 a day. That's now the cost absent Democrats are paying as they continue to boycott the House floor and discussion of right to work legislation. News Channel 18's Alex Dyro joins us now with tonight's top story. Alex? Jeff, despite promises that Democrats would walk onto the House floor this morning, the business of the State House is at a standstill while those legislators opposed to the right to work bill continue to caucus. Empty seats greeted Republicans ready to discuss the controversial right to work legislation Wednesday morning. Only five House Democrats appeared on the State House floor, just a couple short of the number needed for a quorum so the debate could continue. Let us have our time. Let us do it. Let us do it the right way. We compel you to attend. We want you to attend. Please come do the business. But 35 of 40 House Democrats did not heed the call from Republicans to come debate the issue. And those absent are now being fined $1,000 a day. The question is whether someone should show up for work they're getting paid to do. And I'd say that answer is an unequivocal yes for everyone in the state, apparently except for 35 Democrat legislators. Feelings about the Democrats' actions are mixed. Some local voters are fed up. They agree with Republican Speaker Brian Bosma. They just want Democrats to return and get down to business. I believe the Democrats should stay and do their job. That's what the taxpayers pay them for. Um, I just believe that they should vote yes or no. Whatever their opinion is, they need to stay and just vote. Others say this is the reason they voted in those legislators. I think that they're doing what they were hired to do. Uh, the Democratic Party does not want the right to work bill to pass and they'd like it to be put up to a state referendum, giving the population a chance to vote on this because it's an important enough issue that it shouldn't be passed in the back rooms. The House is set to attempt another quorum at 9 a.m. tomorrow morning. Alex Dyro, News Channel 18.